The universe is a vast and complex place, filled with mysteries and wonders beyond our wildest imagination. From the tiniest subatomic particles to the largest structures in the cosmos, the universe is a never-ending source of fascination and discovery. Today, we're going to explore some of the latest findings in astrophysics and astronomy and take a journey through space and time to uncover the secrets of the cosmos. One of the most intriguing and enigmatic phenomena in the universe is dark matter. We know that it exists, but we still don't fully understand what it is or how it interacts with the rest of the universe. Dark matter makes up about 85% of the matter in the universe, but it doesn't emit, absorb, or reflect light, making it incredibly difficult to detect. So how do we study something that we can't directly observe? One way that scientists have been studying dark matter is by looking at the gravitational lensing of distant galaxies. When light passes through a massive object like a galaxy, it gets bent and distorted by the object's gravity. By studying the patterns of distortion in the light, scientists can infer the distribution of mass in the object, including the dark matter. This technique has allowed us to map out the distribution of dark matter in the universe and gain a better understanding of its properties. Gravitational lensing also helps scientists study the structure of the universe on a large scale. By looking at the distribution of dark matter using gravitational lensing, scientists can map out the large-scale structure of the universe and how it has evolved over time. This can help us understand the origins and evolution of the universe. Additionally, it has applications in the search for exoplanets. When a planet passes in front of its parent star, it causes a slight dimming of the star's light. This is known as a transit, and it can be difficult to detect. However, the gravitational field of a massive object like a planet can also cause a slight bending of the star's light, making the star appear brighter for a short period. This is known as gravitational microlensing, and it can be used to detect exoplanets that would otherwise be difficult to observe. However, dark matter isn't the only mystery in the universe. Another fascinating area of research is the study of black holes. These enigmatic objects are formed when massive stars collapse in on themselves, creating an incredibly dense region of space where gravity is so strong that not even light can escape. But how do we observe something that doesn't emit any light? One way that scientists have been studying black holes is by looking at their effects on nearby matter. When matter falls into a black hole, it gets heated up and emits intense radiation, including X-rays. By studying the X-rays emitted by matter falling into black holes, scientists can learn about the properties of the black holes themselves, including their mass and spin. Black holes are also fascinating because they may be the source of another cosmic mystery, dark energy. Dark energy is a mysterious force that appears to be driving the accelerating expansion of the universe. According to current theories, dark energy makes up about 70% of the energy density of the universe. Recently, a group of scientists proposed a new hypothesis that could revolutionize our understanding of dark energy. According to this new study, black holes might be the source of dark energy. This might sound counterintuitive at first, as black holes are known to be incredibly powerful gravitational sinks that absorb anything that comes too close. However, the researchers argue that black holes could also be emitting a form of energy that pushes space apart, counterbalancing the pull of gravity and causing the universe to expand at an accelerating rate. The study proposes that this energy is generated by the extreme conditions that occur near the event horizon of a black hole, where matter is heated to extreme temperatures and intense magnetic fields are generated. These conditions could create a type of energy known as negative energy, which has a repulsive effect on space and could be the cause of dark energy. This new hypothesis is still highly speculative, and there is much more research that needs to be done to confirm or refute it. It's fascinating to think that black holes, which have long been seen as mysterious and terrifying cosmic monsters, could hold the key to understanding one of the greatest puzzles in modern astrophysics. Only time will tell if this new hypothesis holds up. Another major puzzle in astrophysics is the nature of dark matter and dark energy. 
Dark matter is an invisible substance that is thought to make up about 85% of the matter in the universe and is responsible for holding galaxies together. Despite its immense importance, we still don't know what dark matter is made of. Many theories suggest that dark matter consists of new types of particles that interact only weakly with other matter and radiation, making it extremely difficult to detect. Scientists are working on several experiments to try and detect dark matter directly or indirectly. Dark energy, on the other hand, is a mysterious force that is thought to be responsible for the accelerating expansion of the universe. Unlike dark matter, we know very little about dark energy, other than the fact that it seems to be pushing galaxies apart faster and faster over time. The nature of dark energy remains one of the biggest mysteries in astrophysics, and its discovery has completely transformed our understanding of the cosmos. Overall, these three cosmic puzzles, black holes, dark matter, and dark energy, represent some of the greatest mysteries in modern astrophysics. Scientists around the world are working tirelessly to understand these phenomena and unlock the secrets of the universe. And now, it's time to reply to one of your comments. This comment comes from Ibrahim Swiss, who mentions that they found the video too technical to follow and wonders if we are in one. We appreciate your feedback, Ibrahim, and we understand that sometimes technical content can be challenging to follow. We make these videos to provide detailed information for those who are interested in the topic and want to learn more about it. However, we also want to make sure that the content is accessible to as many people as possible. To answer your question, we are not living inside a black hole. While black holes are fascinating objects, they are not conducive to life as we know it. They are extremely dense regions in space where the gravitational pull is so strong that not even light can escape. If Earth were to get too close to a black hole, we would be pulled in and torn apart. Thank you for your question, Ibrahim, and for keeping the conversation going. Thank you all for watching. We hope you found this video informative and thought-provoking. We appreciate your ongoing support, and if you enjoyed this video, please consider sharing it with your family and friends. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them in the comment section below. We would love to hear from you and continue the conversation. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel to stay up to date on our latest videos. Thank you again for watching, and we look forward to seeing you in the next one.